Hi, so I have this uh, LED bulb. Okay, so it's a uh, 10, 10 watt LED bulb that stopped working. So how do you fix this? this? First you have to remove this part. You just put a screwdriver here and work your way around and then it will pop open like this. As you can see it is stuck with this glue. Same around here but once you pop it you can just push it back. And okay problem. This is not the first repair, this is the second repair. So first time one of these blue. Because on the cheaper ones they use less that are not the best quality. So I fixed this and I don't know it lasted like maybe one or two months, I don't remember exactly. And then this one popped. <laughs> because this one anyway is not exactly the same spec as this and it might draw a bit different current but anyway. I just uh, ordered from Aliexpress this band of LEDs. They are the same size because this one different from light bulb to light bulb. They work, it's just what I have. Okay, so how, how do we fix this? First, uh, sorry but I, they have a black spot here when they burn. I just threw the last the one here. So you just use a screwdriver and pop it off from here, break it off. Then you take your trusty chip iron <laughs> and there will be some leftovers. You just hit it till they they go clean. There. So you just hit it now it's clean here. You will most likely also need well, one of these, it's helpful because you can check it without trying to plug it or maybe not, I just find it helpful. Anyway, I'm gonna plug it here and since I don't have a better place to put it to work on it, I will take this piece of wood and I will just drill two holes here. So this is around 4 millimeters not the most precise way but ok let me clean this a bit steady enough ok this is better so this will not fit so I'm gonna use some of this UTP it's just network cable uh, it's solid copper that's what I'm interested in yes so it's solid copper I already cut a piece of it so well Okay, so we soldered this part here. Okay, so I put some solder on it. I have on both sides. I think now it should hold. See, it is working now. 
so this is a successful fix it's not a pre-test I know it's not uh, like this can fill in 100 ways but if it's gonna get it one or two more months of usage it's pretty good to me <laughs> I mean <laughs> I just did it with basic tools no fancy SMD tools or something probably could do a better job with some of those but I think everybody has at least of this one of this iron and a bit of solder and you need some of these repair replacement leads I think you can buy them find them okay so plug this back and it's just going to put it in your appliance bag hope it helps somebody